Oh, welcome to another rock review. <laughs> yeah. So, in the past week, I have been to see Escape Room, a room you escape from. Got it. Oh. Talk about immersive. Yeah, so. I've been to see Escape Room. Um, it's an alright film. Ah, it's ah, it's it's like ah, I don't know. There's a massive fascination with escape rooms in real life at the moment. You know those rooms with clues and shit that you got to do to escape the room. Escape. This film is okay. <laughs> it's not the best in the world. To be fair, it's not full of any actors I really recognise, apart from one, just one. And I'll tell you that man's name. Well, I won't tell you that man's name because I don't know it. But I know what he's been in, one film. The plot, this group of individuals get a package, they open the package, there's a little box, a puzzle box, they work out how to open it after many, many however longs, hours, minutes, days, who knows? Um, but time, film time passes um, and they get an invitation to an escape room. Yeah, so they all turn up to this escape room. There's a plethora of people. This group of people, you get the standard obnoxious arsehole rich guy. You get the military veteran that's been scarred by something that's happened to him in the army and then uh, continuously annoying throughout the film because, oh, something brings that memory up and then they just can't move. They cannot move, they're irritating. You just want them to die to progress the story. Yes. Oh. Then, then you get the geeky person that's done all the escape rooms and kind of like, oh yeah, I've done all of these ones. I've done like 90 odd escape rooms. I know, I kind of know the methodology methodology of the escape room stick with me you'll be fine you get the really intellectual like young person that like is brainier than anyone else and just comes upon clues that nobody else has noticed the lovable chubby guy who is the guy from tucker and dale versus evil ah! yeah he's chubby he's like a chucker trucker even and you get the kind of broken person that's had some sort of tragedy that they probably cause that is oh, just not able to get themselves together. Anyway, the escape room is just room upon room upon ways they get out. It's not a very good film. Um, it's some big like convoluted story about how some group's making them go into this as some part of game for a broader, broader audience. The whole thing's being filmed. I just found the film annoying from 15 minutes in onwards. Just like standard cliche crap. And I wasn't happy. Yeah. I'm gonna rate the film. I'm giving it two fingers out of a four and a thumb, which is five. Two. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. I didn't enjoy it that much. Well, a little bit. It was suspenseful. Its set pieces were okay. They were the only redeeming feature. Don't see it unless someone else is paying. And that is my note on that. Goodbye. Peace out. Give it to me. Give it to me. Give it to me. Give it to me! Let me have it, let me have it, let me have it, let me have it!